Hey guys, it's just cards by Sarah for Wild Orchid Craft. I just wanted to show you the finished product. As you can see, I um, did a start to finish of this one. I use the sweetest thing paper by um, Elena Morgan. It's the green cat story, I believe. Um, and I've just stressed the edges. I've stitched with that sewing machine that I got for Christmas. I've um, coloured some blooms with some Lindy's. And I've got them poking out of every single side bit. Um, I did some tearing and a border punch. I've got some dies in the middle and some die cuts from the collection. I used a circle die and a doily die. Then here I've used the hydrangea blooms in the mix in the vintage set. It comes with pinks and purples and stuff, and that's in the 15 millimeter. Down here I've used the 15 millimeter um, green leaves and my stems. Um, I've also used the brown. Um, it's like brown um, cottage roses and it's a browns and yellow set. This one is a Tuscan rosebud that I sprayed and opened it up. Um, and they're quite little when they come, like a rosebud obviously it would be really tight and I just opened it up. The lily I've sprayed and that came in white. Um, and they're the little lilies. And then the mixed pink tone buds. Again, all the links will be left down below. I've used that organza small trim again. Love it. I halved it and used it up the top and the bottom, but you can only sort of see it peaking in spots. Uh, and then some beads and some sequins. Then up the top, I'm just going to turn it sideways and maybe you can see the details a bit better. So as you can see, that's that organ, that trim. Again, those 15 millimeter leaves in the green. Um, and then I've got my buds, same ones from the um, earth, the pink tone set. And then I've got my lily, which I sprayed with Lindy's. And I've got my aqua wild rose. And I love them. They're in 30 millimeters, and I made it a bit smaller. And I've got the Cosmo Daisy, which was white. And again, I sprayed. And then my buds. But as you can see, all those gorgeous hydro blooms are poking out all around. So they were white. And... I had sprayed them for another project and didn't end up using them, so I used them for this and I'm really happy with how it turned out. Let me know what you guys think. Again, like I said, all the links will be below. Be sure to go check out the Wild Orchid store and also Elena's site for this gorgeous paper set. And I will see you later.